welcome back to the Power Dweeb. Uh, I just got a quick video today because a lot of people online have been discussing uh, this one particular topic. Um, I've had a couple of conversations about it recently on Reddit. And it's just uh, talking about Dino Thunder White. Um, as we know, Dino Thunder Black is finally going to come out in a few months now. Uh, and then at that point, we now have the complete team fully released. Everybody was a little upset with this figure when it first came out because I'll show you the helmet. It was not done well. He, uh, pretty much all of the black accents that are supposed to be around the face shield are non-existent. Which is odd because in the box design, it's there. It's like they, they know it's there. But if you take a look, nothing. It just, it's pretty, uh, like, aside from the fact that it's just not what it's supposed to be uh, for screen accuracy, it's also just bad. It's just, it's not good looking. Uh, there's a reason they didn't design it this way in the first place. But, so Hasbro had to admit they were wrong with this one. And although this figure is... Whoa, I want to say this is a 2001 figure also. This is a 2020 figure. No, I just said 2001. 2021, I meant. But it was 2020. Um, so it's been a considerable amount of time. I, I don't think they really... I don't remember when they started offering the option to ship out a replacement head. Um, but people were discussing, oh, is it even worth getting this figure? Because you have to pay X amount of dollars for him and then find a way to track down the head, blah, blah. Thankfully, um, I just sent them an email on Tuesday. On Tuesday, I emailed Hasbro uh, Consumer Care. I just followed the replacement FAQ on the website. And so that was Tuesday, I sent an email. Wednesday, I got a confirmation. And last night, Saturday night, it was here. They will send you the corrected helmet and boy oh boy it looks good here hold on yeah, here we go side by side this is bad it, it looks like um elementary school fan art design um no disrespect to elementary school fan art designers but you can see in addition to also giving the black accents it also they beefed up the red the width of it and they actually it looks like a little bit more of a uh like a, a ro robust, it's a bolder red. Uh, this is, this kind of has, it's almost pastel-y. This is like the in your face red that you would expect for Dino Thunder White. He was one of the coolest evil rangers ever. This looks like an so, angry bird. I have to say I'm happy with this. Um, you know, it wasn't the best. It is cool actually, I could see him without his little shield on pretty simple costume but it's cool um you know to to get a replacement part thank god they did so i know they're doing helmets for a squad pink i think they're sending out helmets for her as well but so i just emailed them i sent them uh the product number and then there's like a little engraved number on your box on the bottom i sent that in and uh yeah they just had my address on file from my orders it's kind of a bummer that i had to unbox him to fix it but it doesn't really bother me too much because now at least i have a correct figure and it looks fantastic now in my opinion much better um yeah so it's quick and simple man if you have one of these and you need the replacement helmet um it's really as simple as shooting them an email and they'll send it to you for free i didn't have to pay for shipping nothing Maybe there is some customer service to be received yet from Hasbro. Tight.